Welcome back to another video from Lord Gizmo. Today we'll be looking at powerful industrial machines not to be missed. But before that, if you enjoy this type of content, make sure to like the video and subscribe to see more like it. First on the list is the Epiroc Raised Boring Machine, which is a machine designed to drill opening holes in block caves, sublevel caves, and sublevel stopping mines. It also boasts about its versatility, which includes precondition, paste fill tube, and media holes. It can drill conventional, box, and down reaming holes up to 200 meters in diameter and 60 meters in length. This large diameter also allows lesser risks of freezing the ground. In addition, it has the advanced Ezer L system which ensures smooth operation, reduces equipment damage, and improves productivity. This also allows the machine to drill upwards and downwards without using a concrete platform. This machine is designed to perform ditch clearing and it's great at doing so because it has the ability to move through shallow waters. Even when it needs to go through submerged vegetation or other obstacles, it can still get its job done. The machine also showed potential in collecting trash, which is why it was used for this purpose, as you can see in the video. The Berkey Triton 550 has been a great tool at collecting trash in the Bakasai Canal and the Waduk Plute Lake. Thanks to it, trash cannot reach the ocean. A device called the RM85750 is used to clean the ballast tanks of tanker ships by removing sediment and other contaminants. This is a crucial job since silt accumulation in the ballast tanks can hinder the ship's stability and mobility and reduce its fuel efficiency. A tanker's vessel ballast tank can be reached by simply transporting the RM85750, a small and portable machine. It can be customized with numerous nozzles and accessories to clean various sorts of surfaces and blast dirt and debris away with high-pressure water jets. In order to make sure the machine is running securely and effectively, sensors and monitoring systems are also included. The next machine was built to help in the disposal of wood waste. This is the MUS Maxman TGS 540. Thanks to its maximum cutting diameter of 305mm and its ability to handle logs up to 30cm in length, this machine has been very efficient when it comes to performing its tasks. Aside from that, it also has a number of safety features like the load sensing hydraulic system and an emergency stop button to ensure that the operator and the people around it will be safe. It's also very easy to use, and its versatility can expand as the operator adds in attachments and to suit different applications. The CAT 836K compactor is a landfill compactor that features a CAT C18 engine, single lever steering, pressurized cab, and wheel and tip operations that provide extended service life. Thanks to its cat locker differentials, this machine can now offer an improved operation and even smoother directional shifts. This machine also has features like the CAT Compact with pass mapping and optional CAT Compact with elevation mapping that helps boost the productivity of the operator as well as the whole site. On top of that, it also has an improved guarding brought by its an additional axle duo cone seal guards, eyebrow guards, and new reversing fan guard, hence having more protection for the machine to avoid wearing. The Placer and Thurer 0916 CAT is a track tamping machine designed for use in the maintenance of railway tracks. The track's ballast layer can be flattened and compacted by it, keeping the track level and stable. This machine boasts about its two single sleeper tamping units. This offers an optimum tamping vibration frequency of 35 Hz. Operators do not need to worry about its durability too since it has highly wear resistant tungsten carbide tamping tines. The machine has a strong hydraulic system that allows it to compact the ballast precisely, guaranteeing that the track is put back in the right shape and alignment. When it comes to development, construction, and innovation, one of the machines that have earned the trust of the many is the XCMG All-Terrain Crane. This crane is really impressive as it has intense lifting capacity and exceptional side adaptability. With a maximum lifting capacity of 1,000 tons and a maximum outreach of 90 meters, the XCA900LE is one of the largest and most powerful cranes in its class. A popular piece of heavy-duty construction machinery in the building and construction sector is the XLC30000 Crawler Crane. 
It's a particular kind of crane that can access places that conventional cranes cannot because it's built to move along the ground on tracks rather than on a fixed base. It has a strong hydraulic system that enables it to lift huge objects, like construction supplies, machinery, and even automobiles. It is extremely adaptable and useful for a variety of jobs, including the construction of big buildings, the installation of substantial steel beams, and the lifting of heavy gear. Additionally, it is employed in the oil and gas sector for jobs like erecting offshore platforms and maintaining pipelines. Concrete that is laid out in a thin layer and subsequently compacted with a roller is known as Roller Compacted Concrete RCC. This method can be used to reduce the quantity of workers and equipment needed during the construction process, as well as the amount of steel needed to build pavements and other structures. RCC's versatility in use, which includes employment in levees, retaining walls, and pavements, is one of its key advantages. Additionally, it is rapid and very simple to produce, which might assist in lowering the overall cost of construction. In addition to its useful features, RCC has a number of environmental advantages. It requires less energy to produce than traditional concrete, and it can also be made using locally sourced materials, which can help to reduce the carbon footprint of construction projects. The next machine is known to be the new generation K-Series High Power Skid Steer Loader of XCMG. This is the XC760K skid steer loader which boasts about its all-new large space cab and optimized ergonomic design that realizes high operation safety and comfort. This machine also features a maintenance-free sprocket wheel case as well as an easier accessibility for maintenance if other parts need it. The next device is known as the Kama 3 6560. An excavator is a tool used to empty a tank or container of liquids or gaskets. In this instance, the excavator is made to work with Kama's vehicles that need to have a tank or container emptied. The Kama 3 6560 excavator is made to put on the back of the truck and comes with a suction and discharge hose. The removal of liquids or gases from tanks or containers is a typical task in a number of industries, including oil and gas, chemical, and mining. A huge 6x6 truck called the Tatra T158 6x6 is produced by the Czech manufacturer Tatra. It's been manufactured since 1967 and was created as a heavy-duty vehicle. The T158 is renowned for its durability, dependability, and capacity to function in difficult circumstances. It's been employed for many different things, including as the movement of cargo, military activities, and even firefighting. The T158 features a diesel engine that can propel a payload of up to 18 tons. In spite of its age, it's still a well-liked option for heavy-duty applications in many countries. The 50-ton Century 1150 rotator from Miller Industries was created to meet the safety and heavy recovery requirements of towers. It has a three-stage recovery boom, a 360-degree continuous boom rotation, and optional deck and turret-mounted winches. The Raptor TM wireless proportional controls provide record controls and load sensing functions. Miller Industries is the top choice globally for recovery equipment designed for towers' needs and safety. The 1150 and 950 models have a patented roller system that can travel up to 60 inches and start and stop under heavy loads. The Komatsu PC600 is a small excavator with a maximum operational weight of 6,500 kilograms and a typical hydraulic system. With a 2,550mm boom and a 2,200mm stick, it can be used in a variety of applications. Due to its small size, it can operate in confined spaces and access places that bigger excavators could find difficult. Modern technologies like electronic hydraulic control, which increases efficiency and lowers fuel consumption, are included in the PC600. Whenever we see tasks that involve moving of rocks or big structures, we often see bulldozers getting used. Bulldozers are heavy construction machines that have large metal blades they call as the blade or dozer blades. The purpose of these blades are to move materials like soil, sand, rocks, or debris whenever they get raised, lowered, or tilted. 
On the other hand, anchor chains are a strong chain made especially for use with anchors on ships, boats, or other marine craft. It is an essential component for the anchoring system and is critical to the stability and security of a ship while it's moored or at anchor. What if we told you that bulldozers and anchor chains can also be used for other things? Would you believe me that these beasts can also be a helping hand when it comes to tasks in wooded terrain? For improved traction and stability, bulldozers frequently have strong engines and large tracks or tires. They have a powerful pushing force and are made to work in difficult terrain. Bulldozers are frequently employed in forestry, agricultural, mining, and construction applications. Bulldozers are driven by operators who sit in a cab above the rails or wheels. They control the motion of the machine and the position of the blade using joysticks, pedals, and other controls. Modern bulldozers might also be equipped with cutting-edge technology, such as automated functions and GPS systems for precise placement. The anchor chain's main purpose, meanwhile, is to join the anchor to the boat. The weight of the chain strengthens the anchor's holding ability by increasing the horizontal force applied to it and aiding in maintaining the anchor's appropriate alignment. The chain also serves as a shock absorber, easing the strain on the anchor and preventing jerks or unexpected jolts.
the Savannah Global Solutions is here for all of us. They're just one of the many companies who aim to assist on tasks that involve forestry, land clearing, and transformation operations, even up to highway and road constructions. They started their mission of providing a diverse land development product lineup in the year 1987 in Savannah, Georgia, USA, and Savannah Equipment PD LTD in Australia. They now have precision application systems that can be outfitted on bulldozers, forestry skidders, and four-wheel drive tractors. Their machines, products, and services offered are specifically designed to perform well in forestry and agricultural applications. The Savannah Global Solutions is known to be good partners when it comes to addressing challenging soil and site preparation needs. Thanks to their patented Savannah Stump Jump Hydraulic Relief System incorporated with their Savannah equipment including subsoil, bedding, one-way plows, offset discs, and road maintenance equipment, land clearing operations and even preparation for farming have never been so easy. They have ever since assisted in land clearing operations with their bulldozers. Two of their top machines for land clearing and transformation operations are the 900 series blade root plows and 1100 series chopper rollers. 900 series blade root plows. Heavy duty tools for clearing land and controlling vegetation are available under the Savannah 900 series blade root plows. These specialized plows are frequently used in the forestry, agricultural, and construction industries to clear soil, remove tree roots, and prepare areas for different reasons. The Savannah 900 series blade root plows are designed primarily to uproot trees and clear the land of weeds. These plows are designed with strong blades and strong hydraulic systems, allowing them to easily cut through heavy vegetation and roots. Large-scale land clearing initiatives benefit greatly from their ability to manage difficult terrain and dense vegetation. The Savannah 900 series flexibility is one of its standout qualities. Users can select the most appropriate model based on their unique requirements because these plows are available in a variety of sizes and combinations. Models in the range have often varied blade widths and attachment choices, allowing for flexibility for various applications and project sizes. The Savannah 900 series design places a strong emphasis on toughness and endurance. These plows are made of high quality materials and designed to survive harsh circumstances and continuous use. The blades are strengthened to withstand abrasion, ensuring life and lowering maintenance requirements. The Savannah 900 series blade root plows have more uses outside plowing soil. The level of soil disturbance during clearing can be managed by operators thanks to some models adjustable cutting depths. This is especially helpful when working on locations that need little ground disturbance or selective clearing. These plows can also be fitted with extra attachments to increase their functionality. For instance, some models can be equipped with rakes or grapples, allowing the plows to efficiently collect and transfer material. Because of its adaptability, the Savannah 900 series may be used for a variety of land management activities. Safety is one of the utmost importance when it's using the Savannah 900 series blade root plows. To ensure safe and efficient usage of the equipment, operators should get the necessary training and adhere to suggested rules. It is crucial to follow safety procedures, which include donning the proper personal protective equipment and performing routine maintenance inspections. Eleven hundred series chopper rollers. Chopper rollers from the Savannah Eleven Hundred series are known for being sturdy and strong agricultural machinery parts. These strong equipment is made for performing diverse forestry chores. Savannah choppers are meant to work in concert with these heavy-duty rollers. The Eleven Hundred series chopper rollers are designed to be straightforward yet incredibly powerful instruments. Bulldozer land clearing has a large impact on both biodiversity and climate change. 
Plant destruction lowers ecosystems' ability to take in and store carbon, which raises greenhouse gas emissions. This has a deleterious effect on biodiversity and exacerbates climate change. The extinction of plant species throws off sensitive ecological balances and makes it harder for wildlife to survive. Bulldozer land clearing also upsets the food chain and makes it more difficult for wildlife to survive by removing trees and other plants. Animals that depend on particular plants for protection or food risk being displaced and having less resources available to them. Additionally, the intricate ecological functions that intact ecosystems perform, like carbon sequestration, water filtration, and erosion control, are jeopardized. Bulldozer clearance may be useful for agricultural development, but it also has serious environmental consequences. Concerns about this approach include soil erosion, habitat loss, food chain disruptions, detrimental effects on biodiversity, and climate change. Consider alternate land clearance techniques that have a priority on reducing environmental disturbance in order to reduce these effects as much as possible. Striking a balance between human goals and environmental preservation will be made easier by putting into practice measures like reforestation, restoration efforts, and sustainable land management methods. If you found this video informative, don't forget to give it a thumbs up and subscribe to our channel for more exciting content like this. And remember to hit that notification bell so you never miss an update. Until next time, stay tuned for more amazing tools and construction equipment that will leave you in awe. Thanks for watching.